Hi everyone, I want to do this video just breaking down some of the best gyro aiming games on the Nintendo Switch using the Nintendo Pro Controller. What's the boss? These wild horses. I've not played, this is my main playthrough, I've not touched this in a long time. Where? Do we have a horse? I've noticed this since using the Pro Controller back on the Switch. It keeps like sort of stopping, it doesn't work anymore. Are we getting a blood moon? One really unnecessary. That's a headshot. What's going on? Fuck's sake, man. You'd think it's big enough, eh? I'm really not used to the controls, but hopefully we can demonstrate it. Because the, the bow and arrow is the one of the main ways in uh, Breath of the Wild. Oh, you used a gyro? This guy's going quick, man. I can't aim quicker. It's stuck. I can't aim quicker than he's riding. You have to do it free aim. Which is kind of the piece of point of gyro, because I can't twist it that far. And it won't give me the headshot. Like they're head they're both headshots and it won't do it. That's a headshot. I just had this on the goblins. That's a headshot. What the hell? Okay, well basically it's nice and slow, but it's not the best. Um, but it's a good way of learning the gyro controls is with the uh, with the bow and arrow here. It's the only way that's really implemented in, in Breath of the Wild. And you don't have to use it, which is a nice thing. Uh, but it works quite nicely. You just move the uh, move controller. It's quite a delay with this controller. Good lord. It's good to get used to, though. But Jesus Christ, that's a massive delay. Okay. Well, well on to the next one. What? Oh yeah, I said I was going to show my settings, didn't I? Do that. Uh, what have we got on this? It's quite different, this. Uh, 4 and 4, classic, small, the dead zone. Movement, dead zone, small, Half inverted. And then on the motion controls, it's quite different. I, this is definitely not default, the default or the lines. So that's on 2, 20, 20, 2.6, and 10 and 10. Uh, that obviously does need probably a bit of tweaking, but yeah, it seems to work okay. Uh, that's what I kind of got close to what it's like on Steam on the PC using the same controller. Enemy taken down. They aren't the kill leader now. This, I would say, is probably one of the one of the top best games shooters, particularly on the Switch, and it doesn't get any attention. I still, even after I don't play the Switch as much, I still don't hear about Warface on Switch, and it's very well supported on here. I think because it gets 40 frames a second, it's a really nice, smooth, smooth experience. And this is a nice, great little mode to feel the uh, the gyro out. So while we're doing this, let's um. Can I do my settings? No.
We defuse the bomb. Round successful. No way. He beat me to a beat both of us to that. That's mad, eh? Don't know what. Wow, it's nice to play in 60 frames. Holy shit. Wow, it's slow though. And it's been a while. Lean forward for that action. Oh, yeah, this is such a nice, smooth game. Well, it's been a while. Correct, friend. But yeah, this is definitely one of the best, um, one of the best and most popular shooters on the Switch. And to use the gyro really makes this game come alive. It makes sense. They've designed it. They've designed the game around it. It literally sounds like I didn't see it. Lol. Whoop, and this gun's a two-hit kill, which is nice. Final kill we got them. No, this is definitely the best one. The amount of guns, abilities, different styles and things. It's really got a lot of depth in this game, and I really, really enjoyed it. It's still a very good game to play. And this is definitely my number one gyro game, and of course it's gonna be at Splatoon. So no, thank you very much for watching this video, and I shall see you in the next one. If you live if you Yeah, there you go. Motion control sensitivity is five, sensitivity is five. But I started on like four. And I slowly have gotten used to it. So you just find what you're used to, what you can like, and just slowly work with it, and you'll build up over time. It's it's a very hard thing to learn, but once you get used to it, it works really well, and it's a, it feels great. So thank you for watching. Please leave a like if this helped you, and subscribe for more. Bye.